athletes in fall sports head back to practice for a new season starting next Monday. Summer workouts for high school teams in various sports took up much of June and July. We caught up with one local team in late July. Here's John Jacobson with more. On a hot summer day, there's no better place to cool off than an ice rink. But the players in the Osseo Park Center girls hockey program aren't just escaping the heat. They're working hard toward becoming better players and ultimately a better team once the season starts in November. Uh, we've just been working on a lot of skills. Um, if we get the skills down, hopefully we'll be able to put it together in game situations this year, put some more pucks in the net. I think that getting work off season works on both building like a team and getting to know each other better through off ice, but then it also works on your skills during off ice so you can work on power play and penalty kill more in this season. Jeremy Lewis and his staff are in their second year running the program. In addition to dry land training, there's an emphasis here on edge work and shooting and passing, plus one on one and two on two drills, trying to simulate game situations. We're also stressing to the players the need to work on their hockey skills away from these summer workouts. You could, you could see so much more improvement from last year at this time. And just, just from the season, there are so many girls doing outside activities, programs outside of our program to make them better through the summer. You can just see in them just picking up a notch. I think there's a lot of girls there are looking better and better every day at STP and it's really exciting to see how much they've improved. The girls work really hard with all their other sports and hockey as well and it really helps our endurance and our physical component of hockey as well. OPC lost eight one goal games last season. They're hoping some of this off season work will turn those L's into W's come winter. In Brooklyn Park, John Jacobson, CCX Sports. Thanks John and we'll hear from the Champlain Park Coon Rapids girls hockey team later this week.